Golfgate rumbles on and EU Commissioner Phil Hogan is under increasing pressure from both Brussels and Dublin to provide a full account of his attendance at last week's controversial Oireachtas golf dinner. Well, your consultant Peter Brown joins me with the latest on that and all of today's other top news stories including some real concerns being expressed by teachers, unions about how difficult and perhaps unsafe it is for their members to return to work and we'll come to that in a minute but I just want to go to golf gates as it rumbles on. I mean, we've said there in the introduction, Brussels looking for further clarification yesterday from Phil Hogan, Dublin looking for clarification from uh, Phil Hogan. It appears that he is no longer going to be answerable in any shape or form to the Irish public, is he? Or indeed to the Taoiseach or the Tánaiste. But at this point in time, Breda, he is still answerable to Ursula von der Leyen. And it was interesting, I thought, the statements coming out of the EU Commission yesterday. He was never answerable to the Irish government because once he got into that role as EU Trade Commissioner, he was only answerable then to, to basically the, the European Commission. So his fate now lies in the hands of the, the European Commissioner, uh, the European President Ursula van der Leyen. Um, so I suppose the stage for this story has moved from Clifton to Kilkenny, Kildare, Dublin, and now into, into Brussels.